Hello, Class 5-3. Mr. Waterman here with today's language arts lesson in period one. It is Friday, December 11th, 2020. I hope everyone is doing safe and well. We are starting a new grammar point today. Past tense verbs and irregular verbs. We are working on pages 115 and 116 today in your grammar workbooks. Don't worry. If your workbook's at school, you can download a copy of the PDF that I have on my page. Let's get started. Please listen as I read the point. Point number one. Remember that an irregular verb has a special meaning to show the past tense. So for example, Eat, in the present tense, E-A-T, has a special spelling in the past tense. It becomes eight, A-T-E. This is what makes it irregular, okay? Another example is run. In the present tense, it is run, R-U-N, but in the past tense, it becomes ran, R-A-N. Let's look at some examples. Please listen as I read the directions. Rewrite these sentences in the past tense. Please listen carefully as I read each sentence. Number one. We go to the zoo often during the summer. Two, we see a special bird exhibit. Three, the colorful birds sing loudly. Four, they eat worms and seeds. Five, I do visit the zoo often. Let's do one example together. Number one, we go to the zoo often during the summer. Well, our irregular verb here is go, G-O. I'm going to underline it. To change it into the past tense, it becomes we went, W-E-N-T, to the zoo often during the summer. And don't forget your full stop. There we go. Please do the other four on your own. Let's look at the next part. Listen as I read the directions. Finish each sentence with the correct past tense form of the verb. Listen carefully as I read each sentence with each choice. Number six. We come to the zoo one morning. We came to the zoo one morning. Seven. We see the polar bears being fed. We saw the polar bears being fed. Eight. The zoo attendants say many animals live there. The zoo attendants said many animals live there. Nine, she carefully give the food to the bears. She carefully gave the food to the bears. 10. 
The bears eat with their big paws. The bears ate with their big paws. Let's do one together. Remember, we're using past tense. Number six. We came. I'm going to circle came, and I'm going to write it on the line. C A M E. We came to the zoo one morning. Please do the other four on your own. For some extra practice, write three of the past tense verbs on this page, and you can write a short paragraph using these words. You can do that on notebook paper or in your notebook. Let's have a look at page 116. Please listen carefully as I read each point. An irregular verb has a special spelling to show the past tense. Point number two. Some irregular verbs have a special spelling when used with the helping verb have. Let's have a look at present, past, and what happens when we use the past tense with the helping verb have. I do, I did, I have done. You see, you saw, you have seen. She comes, she came, she has come. We go, we went, we have gone. They bring, they brought, they have brought. I run, I ran, I have run. He gives, he gave, he has given. We sing, we sang, we have sung. They begin, they began, they have begun. I eat, I ate, I have eaten. It grows, it grew, it has grown. Now, please listen to the directions for the activity. Write the correct past tense form of the verb to finish the sentences. Now, be careful because sometimes we'll have the special helping verb, have, that might be in the past or present tense. So you have to choose the correct spelling. Listen as I read each sentence. Number one, people blank to the zoo. The verb is come. Two, C. They blank all the different animals. Three, sing. The birds had blank for them a thousand times. Four, go. They blank without thinking about the zoo's problems. Five, grow. They blank bigger and bigger each year. Six, bring. She has blank the zoo's problems to people's attention. Seven, run. The newspaper blank her letter. Eight, give. Angel blank a dollar 
to help the zoo. Nine, do. Other people have blank the same thing. 10, begin. Now the zoo has blank to fix its problems. Let's do a few together. Let's do number one, come. People came in the past tense, C-A-M-E. People came to the zoo. Now let's try one with the special helping verb have. Number three, the birds had blank for them a thousand times. The verb is sing. We need to use sung, S-U-N-G. The birds had sung for them a thousand times. Please try the other eight on your own. For extra practice, write three sentences about a visit to the zoo. Please use the past tense forms of three of the verbs on this page. And that's it for today, students. If you have any questions, please feel free to email Mr. Waterman at any time. Stay safe and healthy and take care. I hope you have a great day studying, and I will see you in just a few moments for your period two lesson. Bye-bye now.